What's going on people? Welcome back to the channel. Welcome back to a brand new video on the Suron. Today we are going to get back out into the streets. It's about 6.30 p.m. About an hour and a half till sunset. We're going to do some exploring out here in the streets of LA. See what we find. As always, if you guys enjoyed the content, make sure you hit the like button on the video. Easiest way to show support. Uh, subscribe if you haven't. We have more electric bike exploration content on the way coming soon. Also, I have a second channel I've been posting to if you want to see more of my content there. First link in the description is where you'll find that. Anyways, let's get to it. It's been a minute. It's been about a week since I've been out on this beast kind of just been chilling at the house but we are back in full swing today Ooh. very nice so i got some bad news well it's bad for me it doesn't really apply to anyone else besides myself uh that e-bike that i was super hyped about that i was supposed to get at the end of this month got delayed all the way to the end of next month which sucked so i was pretty hyped to ride it and show you guys what it was but you know, it is what it is, and it's completely out of my power. A lot of shipping problems going on worldwide right now, so there's uh, pretty much nothing I can do. When I say nothing, I mean absolutely nothing. So, yeah, I gotta wait another month. I was pretty happy to show you guys and do a bunch of videos on it, but uh, it turns out I'll be waiting for yet another month. Nice little, <laughs> it's a fun little route right there. Dude, I gotta replace the brake pads on this bike ASAP. They are so bad. They're like abysmal. They're, they're really terrible. That's for sure gonna be something I do in the next uh, couple days. Honestly, I started holding off on doing all the upgrades for this bike because I was so sure that I was gonna get that new one by the end of this month, but and they told me like it's delayed for another month so i have no choice but to kind of wait and so in the meantime i might keep working on the surround i'm at least going to change the brake pads for sure because like i feel like just in the short time that i've been riding it the brake pads are now like trash like i feel like they're almost dangerous how bad they are and a situation where i would need to stop quickly uh i don't think these brake pads would be able to save me like if it really was bad and I needed to stop quick, I think I'd be in trouble. So, try not to get myself in any too sticky of situations while I'm on this bike, uh, to say the least. But beyond that, you guys know I was gonna do a rear wheel upgrade. I was gonna get a bigger, um, uh, I was gonna get a different back wheel put on with, uh, you know, a thicker tire, like a, a wider tire. So that might be back on the table. I had an order for one and I ended up canceling it because I, you know, on the low, that was before I even talked about getting a new bike, but I don't know. I guess we'll wait and see. I don't like, uh, you know, assuming that, I'll probably be better off if I just upgrade my Suron the way that I was planning to originally. And then, where the hell am I? Uh, and then when the new bike comes, you know, I just rock with it from there. But in the meantime, uh, this bike is, uh, it, it definitely needs some stuff, needs some things. I'm just, <laughs> I'm just wilding right now, straight up. We got a nice little descent right here though. One of my favorites over the 101 freeway beautiful shot right there actually we're gonna duck into here real quick usually i just bomb straight down but i never actually explore what's going on this way Let's take a gander and a look see and see what we can find actually it looks kind of lit i straight up was gonna ride right through that that's water <laughs> that probably wouldn't have been a good idea would have got nice and wet nice day in downtown though I don't know how I ended up here so quick. I wasn't even trying to come out here, really. Huh, what's that way? See the bike? This Suron would be so much more capable if it could just do small bunny hops, I swear. But it can't, so I have to live with what it is. It's kind of like getting a dirt bike and expecting to be able to bunny hop that, I guess. But all those people are walking that way, so I guess... Where am I gonna go? can't really go down that way because that elevator is too small the escalator that is this way is fenced off 
and look, there's even a hole so people could crawl. I, I swear, no matter where you go in LA, if you find a fence, you will also find someone who made a hole in that fence. I do not understand the phenomenon. I'm definitely not fitting through there on the Sauron though. Uh, we're gonna have to figure out an alternate route to get around. I think I'm gonna have to go behind all those people, even though that's kind of awkward. This is the Union Bank Plaza. I've never been here once in my life. Probably will never after this. So, who's that? Uh, where am I? Let me take a look real quick. Uh, okay, why is everything blocked off? See, I was gonna try and go down that stair set, but that's blocked off too. Looks like I gotta just creep behind all these people, all these business folks. All these people who went to college, unlike myself. Okay, they're taking the stairs, which I want to do, but I can't. I mean, I guess I can. Dude, what if I was handicapped? I'd be screwed here. I'm going to have to take the stairs behind all these people. I just have to creep it though. <laughs> Showing off my agility here. kind of fun uh, let's see what else we can get ourselves into as far as stair descents um, what's going on this way this is one we came to last time we went out here oh my god that was kind of fast sick Yep, this is the same path we took last time. We're gonna go harder left here instead of going through that plaza where there's a bunch of people just kind of like meandering, chilling. Starting to like this bike a lot better for riding around in like downtown and stuff like that. The first time I came out here in downtown on this bike, I really didn't enjoy it at all. I, I didn't find it fun. Uh, I think that's because I wasn't comfortable on the bike yet. Now I feel super comfortable on it, so it's a uh, it's a lot more fun. I don't know what's going on up there. We're about to check it out, though. Looks like some uh, some shenanigans are going down. Just wanted to hit that so bad. Excuse me, sir. What's going on here? Was there a fire? I could have sworn I heard a fire alarm, but I'm not totally sure. Dude, I could bomb all those stairs for sure. 100%. That guy's off a good one. Is that the Los Angeles corner? Oof. I think it is. No, I, I, it said Los Angeles County. I thought that was a corner. Damn, I thought I was getting walked up on. Oh my God, she's like Neo in the Matrix. No cares about cars. As you can hear, there's a fire alarm going on over there. So I guess that means there was a little mini fire. Uh, ugh. I'm not planning on coming this way, but we're gonna do it real quick. Um, let's see, which way can we go through here? I'm surprised there's not people sleeping here. Usually there's tons of folks sleeping here in the middle of the day. find this way actually open I don't know what goes that way we're gonna go this way though Ugh. love it all right 
nice little urban uh, exploration in downtown. I totally I don't know how I ended up here. I went way off track of where I was trying to go and then now I'm here. So, you know, that's cool. But anyways, uh, we're going to make this left right here. The last time I came to downtown, I was trying to go to Pershing Square. So maybe we'll try and go there real quick and then um, continue on our way. What's up, dude? Going fakey in the wheelchair. Skills. Uh, I guess since we're out here, we'll go by the 6th Street Bridge. It has been a hot spot lately for just uh, shenanigans and people doing ignorant stuff. So we might see something cool over there if we go check it out. Not totally sure though. Good Lord Jesus Almighty, what in the hell? Very average day in downtown. Sometimes you come to downtown and the content just makes itself. Which is always nice. But sometimes it doesn't, so. You know, the duality of man or YouTube. This is open now? I swear I don't remember this being accessible. I'm having so much fun just ripping around downtown right now. fun I'm having should be illegal right now. Oh, we are over here in the hood now. You got a rich supplier? Got some BMXers. Uh, lots, uh, lots to see out here in downtown. Never a dull moment. I pretty much uh, had to edit out what I just saw because it was definitely not YouTube safe, <laughs> to put it as, as bluntly as possible. Anyways, we are now on 6th Street. We're going to follow this all the way down to the bridge, pretty much. Coming off. That's, what are they even serving? I thought it was a taco stand. It looks like they're serving chicken tenders and hash brown. Honestly, I can't even figure out what they're selling. It smells pretty good though. Uh, I am going to run this light. When you're in downtown, I don't know how many people know this, but you are basically in Mad Max in real life. It is lawless. You just have to like fend for yourself basically. So it's kind of turning into like one of those places where you just don't stop at red lights. You just kind of keep going, especially if you're not in a car. Like you just jaywalk and you don't stop at red lights. You just go, like you just go. There's no reason to stop. Right now we are going to pass through Skid Row briefly and you're gonna see what I'm talking about. But this is Skid Row. So, you know, that's kind of to be expected, obviously. Skid Row is crazy and turns up and uh, a lot of, of madness going down here at all times. But the philosophy kind of stands. Skid Row has kind of evolved into all of downtown LA. I don't even really think there's a difference. Like you come down here and yeah, it's bad, but you know, that part is, that part is just as bad. <laughs> I think, <laughs> I mean straight up, like it's just as bad. It's crazy out there, dude. There is, it is just straight shenanigans, left, right, and center, all up and down, from Skid Row to downtown now. Uh, but it, the crazy part is, people are still paying insane amount of money to, to live in, oh, that street is nuts. Wow, I haven't seen that street in a minute. I think I'm good on going down that way. Uh, the crazy part is, dude, the rent in downtown is still some of the highest in all of LA. Like by a big margin too, not even just like kinda. Like it is, it is super expensive to live in downtown and it is so bad. You know, when I hear a lot of people think 
like uh, when they talk about like how bad LA is and stuff like that, I feel like most of them are talking about downtown specifically because this place is like the epicenter. Like I'd rather, I grew up in, in, uh, in North Side Long Beach and that place is not really friendly either. But I'd rather live there any day of the week than live in downtown again, straight up. <laughs> like straight up. Or at least for the amount of money you have to pay to live in downtown. It is just outrageous. Anyways, we're almost back at the bridge. Let's go see what's going on down there. I'm a little speech on Skid Row in downtown for anyone who doesn't know how I feel about that place for the thousandth time. I don't like it. In case you couldn't tell from uh, you know how I just expressed my thoughts. I am not a fan. And the way I'm riding right now is extremely dangerous. I just want to get that straight. I need to get back on the right side of the road. I was in the bike lane for a minute, so it was kind of chill, but I got to get back over here. Fun little free ride in downtown, though. I can think of some other cool free ride spots. If you guys want to see some more free ride on the Suron, let me know. I'm super down for that. That could be a fun video. Just straight up like looking for stair bombs and like little jumps and stuff to hit on the on this bike let me know if you guys are into that in the comment section down below all right we're almost at the bridge we got a taco section almost at the bridge taco trucks i don't know why it's a taco section and then i did a retake like i'm i don't know anyways yeah so i came here for the opening of this bridge it was super active there's tons of people like thousands and um, ever since then, it has kind of been like a hangout spot. Yo, I'm sliding in on your left. It's kind of been like a hangout spot for just about everybody, not just kids, but adults and, you know, people just love coming to come check out the new bridge. You know, as simple as that. So uh, I might come and chill here for a minute and then keep it pushing. I don't really have much to do right here. And uh, it's actually quite dead right now. A lot of people I've been seeing are going up on these arches. Now that I see it in person, it makes total sense. That looks so easy to walk up. It doesn't look dangerous at all. Now to ride up it, I don't know about that. Homie's trying to call out danger. I feel like anyone I see in a nice car, like that guy just passing an M4 is like, is thinking about doing some crazy stuff. I actually want to take the walkway down. I never even thought about that. I didn't get to check this bridge out properly last time I came, so I'm gonna try and explore it. There's a cop. That is the first cop I've seen. Looks like they're maybe starting to crack down on people doing illegal stuff, like uh, burnouts and whatnot. So anywho. Yeah. This bridge takes you straight to East LA, which is like, uh, if you're not trying to go there, then, well, there's really no reason to keep going once you hit the end of the bridge, which is what I'm gonna do. Let's see if we can safely turn around. You guys are about to see, it is a super nice view going over the bridge the opposite way though. Like super nice. You get a view of the sunset, of downtown, and, uh, you know, people going over the bridge. It's really, really nice. You just need to make this U-turn safely. Sometimes people come flying across this bridge, so you gotta be super aware. Anyways, we gotta take the bike lane. We also have to go right past that motorcycle cop, so hopefully he doesn't care that I'm on the Suron. Most cops are aware that this thing is not a motorcycle because it doesn't have an exhaust sound. But uh, I guess we're about to find out if uh, this cop in particular does care or doesn't. Oh, he's already taken off. Oh, I'm lucky. Oh, well. I'm really, I thought there was a way to get on the bike lane from here, but I don't think there is. Anyways, you can see the bridge has a super nice view of downtown when you're going over it, which is just awesome. Uh, and yeah, so. Oh, actually, I think this is it right here. Oh, wow, this looks like it might make me dizzy. Yep. I actually don't know where this leads. I'm just getting a mad photo shoot. Okay, this looks like I'm going to get dizzy 100%.
this is like a car park uh, a car park you know entrance exit you ever go to like one of the big uh, parking lots nope. let's go ahead make a right those dudes were smoking on gas <laughs> let me just put it that way they were smoking on some gas Damn, look at that graffiti down there. Hold on, that looks sick. Can I get a shot of that? Dude, look at all that graffiti down there. That's, that is dope. That's such good artwork. They're having another little photo shoot down there. This is just a current photo shoot spot. That's what I figured out. It's like everyone's coming here to get the photo shoot on, which I, you know, not mad at it whatsoever. First come, first serve. Oh, so this just spits you out at the other side. Interesting. Well, he didn't care at all. Uh, I'm still going to wait for him to go all the way across before I jam all the way through. Actually. You know what? I want to go and see where this, uh, this bike path spits you out at. And then we're going to go from there. Because I was curious. Last time I came, I wanted to see where... The bike path ends you up at if you follow it all the way out. Looks like it just shoots you out to another bike path, which is awesome. Very nice. Beautiful dogs. I don't like this turn. I don't like these turns. They're like big sweeping turns just kind of make me dizzy. I don't know if Anyone else like that? Are you like that? If you go around like a big sweeping turn, even in a car, do you get dizzy? Like when I have to come out of these in a parking lot in a car, like I want to throw up. All right, well, we're done with that. And it spits us out on this bike path, which I don't really know where exactly it is. Probably on the other side of the bridge. You know what I just realized? We're gonna have to go back up because now I don't know how to get back over to downtown without going back over the bridge. Oh, that's what it's there for, right? Let's see, what is this? Where am I even going right now? This is like off the beaten path. It looks like I'm going onto the railroad tracks or something. This is obviously a homeless camp and a park. I don't want to go across that stagnant water. Doesn't look like there's any way across right here. Just, uh, just a camp. People looking at me crazy every single direction. So we're gonna keep going. We get to go across this graffiti and check this out real quick, which should be cool. We're just gonna look at it while I go past, so you guys can check it out. Very, very dope. I thought you were talking to me. No names I recognize though. I like that. <laughs> yeah, okay, well, turns out we gotta go back over the bridge. Go we'll figure. Well, that's what we're gonna do right now. Just gonna go ahead and keep bombing down it. Back to downtown. I was gonna try and make a ride in the hood video today, but I mean, I don't know. I guess we still kind of could. I gotta get back up. I did not expect to go through downtown, but you know. <sighs> nice day for a cruise though. What the hell was that, dude? That looked like a pile of blood. I don't even want to know, honestly. That, that looked kind of crazy. I'm pretty sure this is a bike path route, or maybe it's just a walk route. I really don't know. I thought it was a bike route, but I could be wrong. Looks like a few more people are starting to show up. Hey, how do I get off? Just walk away. I gotta go back here. Nothing going on in the 
the bridge right now, so. What's up, kiddo? What's up, man? What's going on? Are you out here filming? Yeah, we filming right now. Okay. Is that Dana Man? Bro, I didn't even know it was you. Yeah, 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 yeah. Was that, yeah. Was that you? Really? What's up? Homie straight up motorcycle through the bike lane. Love it. Can't be mad at him. Well, the sun's already setting. Yep. So I'm gonna go ahead and bust a move up on out of here, honestly. Did not want to be out here this late. I kind of got caught up talking with some of my homeboys. Easy Bike Life and Dan the Man. Two cycling legends out here in LA. Good friends of mine, always happy to catch up. Chat with them for a sec, but now, I'm gonna go ahead and make my way up out of here. I'm trying to look for an exciting way to go. Easy hopped on my bike and wheelied it with such ease. That kid is a natural at anything with two wheels. Amazing. Uh, let's see, which way am I gonna get out of here? Where am I right now? I'm gonna go ahead and make a U turn. Thought that was a cop behind me. Just a dude and a challenger. One thing that is like new to me about riding this bike in traffic is that when you're riding with the flow of cars, I'll look back sometimes and there's a car like right there on my ass. Like, that is a scary feeling sometimes. Like to turn around and then boom, there's a car like right on your bumper. It's kind of crazy. Looks like I have the walk sign right here. Look at this poor old bridge. People used to come here to take pictures, but now no one cares about it at all. Uh, we're just gonna go ahead and dig. Gonna fully dip out of LA. Gotta go through Skid Row again, which I am not too stoked about. But this is like the chill part of Skid Row, if that is even a thing. This building has been painted the same way for like 10 years. That's kind of crazy. Making our way through a very sleepy downtown. <laughs> what the what was that guy doing? <laughs> Anyways, we are gotta we gotta make some moves. We got a long way to go. I parked so far. This guy's dog loose. Thought that dog was on the loose. I was like, I am for sure gonna get chased. One hundred percent. Off a good one. Things you see in downtown. Oh, that dog is adorable. I don't know what it is, but I love it. Gotta go through the tunnel. on the sidewalk because people like speeding through this tunnel it's kind of sketch hopefully there's nothing on the sidewalk here also crazy how it's noticeably warmer once you hit the tunnel oh wow that was a gigantic stick kind of chilling 
I don't really know. I can't see that well what's on the sidewalk. It's kind of dark down here. So I'm not trying to go like max speed. Oh wow, it feels so much better the second you get out of that tunnel. Alright, this is the tricky part. We gotta get across two major streets and then we gotta go across the freeway. All while checking traffic. And the cars here are super impatient, so you gotta be careful with this part. I'm gonna stick to the left lane here, I think. That might be the way. I don't know when our turn's gonna be. Hopefully soon. Yep, let's go. That dude just walked from off of the freeway. Where's it coming? Where's it going? Nobody knows. All right, this is a 110 off ramp. Be careful, cars right here, and we miss a light. So we're pretty much chilling from here, though. We just gotta get across this street. This is the last, like, sketchy one. Be good. Wondering how the GoPro performed today. I really like how the GoPro looks, but the audio has still been kind of hit or miss for me. Even with this windsock, I thought I was gonna be the ultimate solution, but uh, not quite. It's not quite working out as well as I thought it would. Only when it's really windy and I'm going like kind of fast is when it, it starts to fail. But, you know, it definitely fails under those circumstances, so. It's not really my favorite thing. It's when I can't hear audio at any time. Oh, look at that view. Beautiful. Simply beautiful. I'm take a right here and take a little shortcut. Not really where I wanted or planned on riding today, but it's still a pretty cool video. I had fun. If you guys enjoyed the video, make sure you hit the like button on it. Make sure you subscribe to the channel if you're new here. We post around videos every week, exploration and uh, all types of stuff like that. So, so always thank you guys for watching and uh, that's it. See you guys in the next video very soon. Peace out.